Average Roblox player? Roblox player with 10,000 power. I think it's safe to say that the average Roblox player is not that powerful. I'm going to change that today. I'm going to give people an opportunity to increase their abilities, their strength, their power. We've all seen those mobile game ads where there's some chick waiting in line. She says that she's going to cut in front of everybody because she has 500 power. And then some big jack dude walks in and says, I have 10,000 power. I've never actually seen anybody play one of those games. I'm going to put it into my hands. I'm going to create a game where you're able to obtain power. First things first, we need to make the power system. And look at that. It's already there and implemented, all right? Right now, it's just a number. I made this block over here where if you hold it down, it gives you a little dopamine hit. Up there, it ups it to 70. Not only did we get the power system implemented, it saves if you leave the game. So if I stop and play the game once again, in. check it out bro it stays the same but that's just a number what the hell are we gonna do with that that's boring all right i don't know if you've ever played those muscle building games but they scale your player with the amount of power that you obtain and i like it a lot so let's give it a shot before i show you guys what i ended up doing i went on discord and i found a builder to build me a nice environment for me to be running around i sent him a schematic and he got started but we did it ladies and gentlemen and i don't know if you guys noticed but i'm a little bit short <laughs> got that kevin hart disease right whatever he has but check this out baby if i walk up to this little button right here and i click the e to interact button it gives me power and it also gives me a little inch to my height so i could attract more ladies okay <laughs> I bet some of you short kings out there wish you had this button. I added a little treat. If you get past 100 power, something a little bit tasty happens. <laughs> oh, baby. 100 power makes you absolutely jacked. Whatever that disease the rock has, it gives it to you, baby. Holy crap, I'm about to go bench this whole base plate. People used to call me bacon hair, but now they call me muscle body. <laughs> Oh, damn, I'm kind of thick. Yo, what the Fibu hell? Fibu strings. What happened to me? You're, why are you so small? <laughs> yeah. What the hell? Because you have what zero power. You need some power, son. You gotta catch up, boy. Get Nick, he has zero power. What the hell? Dude, bro? How do I what get a new. Oh you have to be so good weak. at the game, bro. I, oh, bro, I can't even like see Nick freak. right now. <laughs> it's like a little this dude, is this is terrible, bro. bro. I could eat you, Nick. You wouldn't even be 10 calories. <laughs> get away from Nick. Let me get stronger. I'm trying to get power, oh bro. God. Damn, yeah. bro. You play soccer or something? Kick it off well, the map. You kicked me off the map. <laughs> we need different ways to collect power, all right? How are we going to give these players power? I thought of six different unique ways to let players obtain victory sauce that we call power the first way that the players are going to collect power is they're going to sell illegal substances now these substances are not drugs okay i repeat they're not drugs they're just substances that are illegal in power city we ended up changing the name to candy which is the same thing because candy is illegal in power city the next way to obtain power is you're going to be able to kill NPCs that are walking throughout the power city. Now, power city is a crime-ridden, degeneracy-filled city, all right? So these people that you're, you are killing, they are not the greatest people. So you're receiving power from criminals, pretty much. And these people actually respond, so don't worry about the efficacy of this. Before I show you guys the next few ways to obtain power, I wanted to take a look at how the city's going so far. Progress on the city was coming along pretty nicely. Uh, it was a perfect scale that I was looking for, and it actually looked a little bit better than what I was expecting. Uh, there's still a lot to do on the skyscraper front, and I was a little bit nervous to see how this would turn out, but so far so good. Really like the realistic approach really appreciate this guy he's doing a great job all right let's get back to the powers the next power up that you're going to be able to use to collect power is the boogie down power up all right you get to just get on a dance floor and boogie down go get you a drink of water anytime you need to go afk you just click the emote button do a little dance every second or two you're gonna get some power nice idle thing that you could do to get power easy the next way to obtain power. Every five minutes, I'm going to spawn something called a stash throughout the world. There's going to be a random location where the stash could spawn. And if you find that stash, this is one of those big boys that's going to hit you with it like 50,000 power or something, some crazy high number. And this is going to be a big way to obtain power in Power City. Now, the last way to obtain power for right now is going to be the black market. <laughs> 
now the black market. You get to go and sell something very vital to your human being, and that is your organs. You only have a limited amount of organs. There's a catch, all right? The more power that you have, the more power you're going to get in return by selling it in the black market. So you want to save this for the end of the challenge. You only have a limited amount of organs, so you can only do this three times. If you try to sell your organs past that point, you get killed, baby. <laughs> And that's all the power-ups. The builder laid out the map already and we just jumped into the game and started trying to implement the logic for the gameplay while he was working on it. It was going pretty smooth and we got 99% of the things working. It was actually looking really good. I wanted to give a chance to show off this beautiful map. Look at this place. Got a nice scenic water fountain in the center of it. A basketball court. Once you get past the center, it gets a little bit samey, but there's a lot of quests that you can do. You could actually see the candy quest over there. My favorite place in the entire city is Club Dodo. Check this out, dude. I made this poster right here. Want free power? Type slash e dance. Hell yeah. Hey, the stash bond. Cool. Walk into Club Dodo. Look at this absolute party place. There usually is music, but I turned it off because it's annoying me. Can you believe? that that dodo was sitting in the toolbox crazy but you and your boys would come in here you'd have to toggle your size off so yeah you would go to the front door of club dodo toggle your size make sure you could actually flip fitting in the building walk in here and in chat as the poster says slash you dance and then obtain some power baby give me some power give me some power everybody give me give me some power i think it's bugged right now i don't know maybe they added a multiplier if you're in there um this is not supposed to be happening anyway i lost the footage from the play test but the first play test was terrible all right it was not fun it was kind of hard to tell what to do and it was just kind of boring so we made a few changes we made it where you could kill other players and obtain power from that you could kill other players it would take their power and put it into your bank. That made it infinitely more fun. But we had another issue. The game was insanely laggy whenever we got into it. We could not figure out why the game was lagging so hard. And it turned out to be because of the dance script. The script that checks if the player is dancing and gives the player power after a few seconds. Well, this was being called every single frame or something and it was causing some crazy issues. I wanted to have a challenge at the end of the video where everybody competed for 10,000 Robux, but looks like I'm gonna have to postpone it till like next weekend or something. And if this video does well, we'll definitely do it. So join the Discord if you wanna be a part of the challenge, baby. Bye, love you, thank you for watching. I love you.